Hey guys, welcome back to another video of Legend of Runeterra. Today we are gonna play a champion I did not play in a hot minute. This is a gangplank deck, 5 mana cost. When you summon him, he gain a powder kick. Plus his overwhelm, he excess damage I did to my blocker is dealt to the enemy nexus. One thing that is implied but not rightly stated, if you kill a unit that is blocking him when he is attacking, he still deal damage to attack the enemy nexus. If he does not have overwhelm, that does not happen. When you damage the enemy nexus 5 plus rounds, he level up and now when he attack, deal 1 to all enemies and the enemy nexus. So, Powder Keg is the name of the game, 0 mana cost, cannot attack or, de or block. It is vulnerable, so any enemy can pick it and decide it will defend against him. 1 health, 0 power. But all your spells and skill deal 1 extra damage. But it destroys me when you spell or skill damage an enemy or the enemy nexus. This is very nice for Gangplank because if I have 2, that would mean when I attack, I deal 2 to all units and the enemy nexus. And we have quite a few ways to get it. Most important of them all is Mischievous Murray, which when you play a spell, summon a Powder Keg. One champion that can create a lot of spells is Samira, to mana cost quick attack, so she strike before her blocker. If she strike or she is summoned after you do damage to the Minixus, she create Flare, one mana cost burst spell that give allied Samira challenger this round or deal one to the enemy nexus once you have she see you play six different cards reset when you start a round with attack token she level up and when you play six round rally so you can attack multiple times in one round multiple times that you can use gank like in it's funny when it gets going let's see how it goes okay let's get started I will reroll this one and keep the rest. Not a bad start. Not perfect, of course, but not bad. We are playing against Rise. This can go either way. But we are gonna start with cross shot, cross course air. Okay, I am gonna attack first. He's gonna defend. I don't care. Again. We are playing against Rise. So, against Rise, most probably he's gonna try to use his landmark. One of them will deal 2 damage to the weakest enemy. And that will kill whatever unit I have. So, may as well use it. Instead of losing. With the power of time, the possibilities hey, but are rhymes. endless. Anyway, Dreadway deck hand. Okay, he killed my powder pick. Better than nothing. Three mana. Summon Legion pride. Saboteur. Okay, yeah, let's attack. Most probably he's gonna kill Legion Saboteur. I was wrong. I take it back. Still worth it. I, de I dealt one damage. That will go toward Gangplank. Dealt into the past, so he's gonna summon his first. Ward rune. I am gonna summon wildfire. This will deal one damage to the enemy nexus and create plunder effect. So three, four, gangplank, 
And can summon no Samira with Flare. It can be undone. Pass. I don't care. My health is not an issue in this fight. Mm. Okay, so mischievous Mare. Now I am gonna use Flare. Gain Challenger. Give it to Samira. This will summon Powder Kick. Use Challenger to attack his aspiring Chronomancer. Doesn't matter. Every time we use a spell, Misty First Murray will give us Powder Cake. For example, when I use Flare, I can deal 3 damage to the enemy Nexus and make us closer to Gangplank. And when I have Gangplank leveled up, I can use Playful Trickster to attack twice with him. This will give me twice the effect. Okay, he's gonna predict. I am gonna use crack shot cross air before he summon his board rune. Mm -hmm. Draw two your I am keeping crack shot cross air as target for his word rune so that he does not kill Samira. Okay, he refilled his spell mana. I summon Gangplank. Now his target will be Powder Keg. Pass my turn. Okay, I think we all know what is going to happen. Bilge water. Mm -hmm. Okay. I know I will regret this, but I will bring back. I will use Playful Trickster, stop Gangplank from attacking, and this will give me Rally again. As long as we have stun or frostbite, I don't care. Just survive this fight, please. So. Smart. Okay, I outplayed myself. Now gang like leveled up. Unit did one damage to the enemy nexus. Good for you. I have more powder. I just need to wait as long as he does not win directly right now. I'm gonna have a very good fight. But he is gonna kill my powder kick first. Okay, rune prison. Pass. He should attack with clock, clock link to get rid of powder kick. Exactly. Okay, let's go more powder plus mischievous murray that will give me three powder keg. Got a gift for you. Okay. 
Dread with deck hand will allow me to summon one more powder cake. So when I attack right now, that is four damage. Let's go for it. And best. My turn, that is five. So when I attack, that is six damage. Challenger. Seven damage. Plus two damage. That is eight damage just from attacking. Let's get rid of this guy and to Bullet to the face. 8 damage plus 8 damage. Okay. Does he have a way to stop my skills? That is the question. Okay. Nice. I actually thought it would act deal 16 damage because they are one after the other, but that did not happen, so I need to keep that in mind. No one's the wiser. Legion Saboteur and should not have summoned. Two, 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 two. He has one health. Kill him. Kill his nexus two, draw one. With his spell mana, all of them are good. And gain a rune prison, which is annoying, to say the least. Most probably he has another one. Mm -hmm. Okay. So that tell me most probably I can win the next round. I'm sure somebody in the comment is gonna get angry why I did it that way. I should not have given plus two damage to Samira should have done this or that, which is true. Hang them by their entrance. Line them up. But this is more fun. I wanna win with my skills. Literally. I hope you like the video. If you do, please share, subscribe, hit the notification button, and put in the comment what other champion or deck you'd like to see next. Bye! Do.